Hey guys, so today I wanted to talk about protective extension reflexes and how I memorize them. And I like to visualize a clock for this. Also, just a reminder that once these reflexes are present, they should persist throughout life. So the first reflex I wanted to talk about is your protective extension downward reflex. And you'll typically see this in a kid around four months. So to test the protective extension downward reflex is when you hold the infant vertically and then you rapidly lower it down towards a supporting surface. And so the baby should respond by extending the lower extremities. So I like mentioned earlier, I like to remember these by just thinking of a clock. And so for this one of the protective extension downward reflex, I like to think of it how happy we get when we hear that we just have a half day during OT school or whatever kind of school that we're in. And so we jump up and down and that's your extension of your lower extremities. So this is where the clock imagery is gonna make way more sense. So typically when you draw a clock, you'll draw 12, three, six, and nine. But if you draw six on top, this will just make way more sense and I actually really like the visual of it. So when actually testing this reflex, what you do, you grab the baby and you suddenly tip them forward towards a supporting surface. And what should happen, the baby should have an extension of the upper extremities with their hands open and a neck extension. So if we're thinking of this like a clock, you see the arms are forward. And so I like to think of it this way. So before our professor said we had a half day and now our professor is like, actually you're gonna have to stay here for six hours. And so we're tired and so we start leaning forward on our desk. So the next reflex is your protective extension lateral reflex. You'll typically start seeing this around nine months. And the way you test this is that you have the baby in a sitting position and then you kind of tip them off balance towards the side and the baby should have a lateral arm extension. So back to the school day reference, now our professor is like, hey, actually, just kidding about six hours, you guys are gonna actually have to stay for nine hours. And then you start leaning towards the side, just sad about your half day turning into a nine hour day. So the last reflex we're gonna talk about is your protective extension backwards reflex. And you should see this typically around 12 months. And the way that you test this, you basically have the baby and you should just firmly kind of tip them off balance backwards and you should see a backwards arm extension. Back to the school reference, now your professor is like, actually, just kidding about nine hours, you're gonna have to stay here for 12 hours. So now you're just done with it and you're just leaning back on your chair and just be ready to go home. So let's go back to the clock imagery. So I know this is not the way a typical clock is rotated, but let's say it's kind of flipped and let's say um, six months or six hours is on top, 12 months is at the bottom, and then nine is on the side. And then you can kind of see that apart from thinking about it, like how you're tired, how I said before, where you lean forward sideways and then backwards, you can also kind of see it on the way the arms of the clock go. And so six months or six hours is your protective extension forward. Your nine months or nine hours is your protective extension lateral. And then your 12 hours or 12 months is your protective extension backwards. But just to review again, I filled in the clock well, our protective extension clock, like a typical clock, would be filled in. So starting out with the protective extension forward reflex, you'll start seeing a kid develop this reflex from about six months to seven months. The next reflex you should see the baby develop is your protective extension lateral reflex. And you can see this happening around seven to 11 months. And the last reflex is your protective extension backwards reflex. And you should see the baby have this reflex from about nine to 12 months. All right, so let's review all of them. So the first one is the protective extension downward reflex, and this typically appears around four months for a kid. And then the next one is your protective extension forward reflex. It should be present around six months. The protective extension lateral reflex should be present around nine months. And then the last one is your protective extension backward reflex, and that should be present around 12 months. All right, well that is it. So hopefully this clock imagery helped you guys memorize these protective extension reflexes. And yeah, so that's it. So anyways, good luck with studying and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.